What's up guys, this is my first ever YouTube video on Wolverine Toy Reviews. So, first, for my first video, I'm going to be sh going over and reviewing the Masters of the Universe Origins Wave 1 action figure line. So let's hop right on into it. So, first figure, we got Master. here I'll move it over, that, got Masters of the Universe Origins, new for 20, Evelyn. So we got the iconic yellow skin with the purple and blue hat and clothing. Then we got the purple boots and stuff like that. That's basically the figure. And it comes down here with a comic book. I don't open my figure, figures. Leave a comment down below if you, if you do. But I just keep them in the box. They're worth more money then. Modern posing retro play. Evil Inn, Evil Warrior Goddess. Tell. Over on the back side, we have the artwork on her. It says, Evelyn wields frightening magic, making her both Skeletor's greatest ally and his worst enemy. Uh, that's the first wave. I have every single one of them, and I will be showing you guys every one of them. She, she, you could twist her body into powerful battle positions. You could fit crystal ball into her hand. And now I'm going to read the description, and then we'll move on to the next figure. Modernizing and celebrating the original 80s Masters of the Universe action figures. Masters of the Universe Origins gives you the power to pose Eternia's greatest warriors as retro-style figures. Or in new action-packed battle positions. Yeah, that's basically the figure for Evil Inn. Pretty cool figure. And now we will move on to Mandarin's. Man at Arms, we got the green skin. Well, not skin, like green, you know. You know. And then he's, yeah, with the black mustache, with the blue and yellow hat, and the orange armor. Red boots, too. And he also comes with a comic book. I'll read you. Man at Arms, heroic master of weapons. He is Tila's, uh, Adopted father. Alright, it says, Weapons, Masters, and Royal Advisor. Man at Arms assists He-Man in the battle against evil. Then we got the artwork of him. I just read you that, so. Fit mace into hand. And twist into powerful battle position. New for 20. 20. Yeah, that's the Man at Arms figure. And now we will move on to Skeletor. So, with the Skeletor figure, it also comes with a comic book. And he has blue skin, purple armor, greenish yellow face, red, red eyes, and a black mouth. And the purple boots. Skeletor. Evil Lord of Destruction and He Man's mo worst enemy. So, you know, his main enemy. And then we got his artwork for the box. This is the Nefarious Overlord Ske Skeletor. Wants to control the power within Castle Grayskull. Fit Havoc Staff into hand and twist into powerful battle positions. New for 2020. I'll give you one last look of the figure. This one's so common at Targets and Walmarts. It's, like, not even funny. Alright. So, that's Skeletor. Next up. Well, this was the hardest one to find. Still, probably is. We got the Beast Man for the first wave. He has the orange skin and the red armor and the blue paint. Beast Man, Savage Henchman. He's evil. He's... Skeletor's henchman, same as Evil Lynn. But yeah, new for 2020. Ooh, that artwork's actually very cool. Man of Germs is artwork. The ferocious beast man uses mind control to force animals to do Skeletor's evil bidding. That's actually awesome. That's actually very cool. That's probably the best artwork 
after I'm done showing you guys all the artwork, I want you guys to comment down below which one you think is the coolest artwork for the figures. You can fit the whip into his hands and twist into powerful battle position. New for 2020. Oh, forgot to tell. It does come with a comic book. Alright. So next up, we got Tila. Uh-oh. Okay, okay. So for Tila, it says... Heroic warrior goddess. He man, man at arms is adopt the child, and he man's uh, crush. Over whatever. Modern posing retro play. Master of the Universe Origins, new for 2020, and she also comes with the comic book with the white skin, the red, uh, base, the red armor, the green uh, armbands, and the brown boots. And then over on the back side, we got Tila's artwork, her fighting merman, and yeah, about He Man, and everybody watches. Got fit magical staff into her hand and twist into powerful battle positions. Pretty cool. Oh, forgot to redo this one. As captain of the Royal Guard, Tila fiercely fights to protect Eternia alongside He Man. Pretty cool. Yeah. And now, last but not least, we got the master of the universe himself. Most powerful man in the universe. He-Man. He-Man's also very common in stores. So, we got his comic book. He-Man, most powerful man in the universe. Pretty cool. Uh, He-Man's artwork's pretty cool as well. With the mystical power sword, the mighty He-Man protects Eternia from the forces of evil. Includes comic book. You can fit his power sword into his hands to fight Skeletor, and you can twist into powerful battle positions. I'll just read you this again. Modernizing and celebrating the original 80s Master of the Universe action figures, Masters of the Universe Origins gives you the power to pose Eternia's greatest warriors as retro-style figures or in new action-packed battle positions. So the heroic warriors are He-Man, Tila, Man-at-Arms, and the evil warriors are Skeletor, Evelyn, Beast-Man. That is awesome. So that's basically, that was my first video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'm gonna do more videos of me reviewing my action figures. As you can see, I have quite a lot of them so yeah and that's about it for today's video guys see you on the next video peace